hey guys and welcome back to the channel so i have a one pan meal which i made a little boat for the chicken so that the chicken won't bother the veggies and then i have some of the brussels sprouts i love brussels sprouts with a little bit of seasoning on it and a little bit of olive oil roasted brussels are the best and these are the mini uh, baby kind of uh, Brussels. I was like laughing because I was like, these are so small. But yeah, those are just the baby ones. And then I have broccoli and corn mixed together with seasoning and a little all. On this right here, if you're wondering what kind of uh, chick what kind of sauce I put on a chicken, I just went to the store and got some of the Campbell's sauce oven sweet teriyaki chicken. And this is just add chicken and vegetables, and boom, you have a meal. So, if you're a single mom or just a mom in general, and you have kids or a kid, and you know how time is, it's hectic like it's hectic, it's stressed, stressful, and you're just trying to get a meal on the table and get the kids kids settled in and quiet and everybody fed so you can have your mama time late at night um because me personally I work all day and I I come in like five something and yeah I, I just want to feed the kiddo and get it over with so today I'm not going to have this for dinner um, and I want to just come and show you, share with you guys what I do on like Saturday night so I can have it ready for Sunday. Um, and I'm going to be scrambling and trying to figure out, well, you know, what am I going to do? I love just the run to go to one pan meal. This is just a sheet pan. Um, normally people just put like toast, I guess, on here and make baked toast or whatever. But I use it for my one pan meal. And I just thought that it would be like good for your budget it'll be good for just saving some coins keeping some money in your pocket and so i just went to the store and went to the frozen section you can also do it fresh as well or organic vegetables however you want to do it um and you can definitely do it vegan you don't have to have the chicken you just have roasted veggies um but all i bought was the brussels the the frozen brussels the frozen corn frozen um broccoli um florets and then I bought um, some chicken breast at um, my local Tom Thumb. They are awesome there. They always say I have like a coupon code like 30% off or 50% off. And I got these like 30% off. Um, they were only like $3 and I got 30% off of that. So I saved a little bit of money. So one of these I'm just going to shred up and have it like on top of my veggies or on a salad just to have like a chick a sweet and teriyaki chicken salad or something like that and then on the other one i'm just gonna cut in strips and then just have it like that in portion size moderation hi it's me. oh look at your little outfit mommy bought you look. what is that transformers uh -huh. i'm so happy you into trans transformers a lot now Look at that. You got your new book, baby? Okay. So the seasonings that I put on um, all this, which it has its own sauce and his seasonings in it. But I do go in and add a little bit of sesame seeds. I use this cur uh, this Curse uh, uh, Aromat seasoning. Really good if you're not trying to use like a heavy seasoning. If you're not trying to use like a, you know, something heavy on your veggies, I would go in with this. I love this. And you do have to order this from like Amazon. Um, this right here, I always get it from the same uh, seller from England. Um, and he sends it to me whenever I get it or order it. And this is like five bucks. And it do last me like forever. Um, and then um, I got... Some of the stone meal, Himalaya sea salt. I just grind a little bit on that. Um, and then some black pepper. Um, and then my favorite, parsley. And then here's the sesame seeds here. Just have it in a little mason jar. And then some onion powder. Um, most of these seasonings didn't cost me anything but like change. So instead of, I mean, in, in, um, except the, uh, Kerr's auto aromat seasoning, but yeah, this is just the one pan dish run to go to 
Girl, you know, when you are in a rush, you know, you don't have time to put nothing on for the kids or yourself. Um, this right here, you just plate it all up and put it in a, like a bowl, whatever, and just have it for tomorrow. Throw it back in the oven or the fastest way, put it in a microwave and go. It still tastes the same. Um, so, yeah, but so I'm not going to eat this tonight. This is for tomorrow, like I said, but tonight I'm going to try this. This um, organ, organic nutrition uh, meal replacement that I have here. Since you can put like, you know, um, like um, fruit and stuff in it. So, I'm probably just going to drink it like this. Yeah. And so, how I portion out most of my stuff for like my lunch at my work. Um, I know a lot of people like to food prep on... Um, yeah, meal prep on Sundays, but I just like doing it like this because it's quick, it's easy, and like I said, it's a run-to, go-to type of meal. Um, I use this little bowl right here just for portions. I'm I'm learning you guys to um, use these for like just my portion size, and they also have like different numbers on there where you have for measuring, and that's what I use it for. Um, and I use this for more mostly of like my short days at work for lunch or whatever, and I don't. Definitely don't want to overfill myself. And I tried this the other day. The mocha with uh, almond milk. And it tastes so freaking good. So if you go to Walmart and you run past this, definitely grab it if you're into almond milk. But this is so good. It's not super sweet. And it's not heavy on your stomach. So I have like a little bit of this in the morning. And then I have some left over for like the next morning. Just make sure you put it in the fridge it's ASAP. I have to get it done with it. And then I'll just take a little bag of fruit. And then I also made Ashton a lot of these for during the week for him to grab his fruit and stuff like that. But um, I love strawberries and grapes too together. So um, I'll have a little bit of this for like my snack or whatever. So yeah, that's <laughs> how I work. That's how we, that's how we roll. That's how we roll. So yeah. But, yeah, anyways, you guys, I just want to come over here and tell you guys, show you guys how I make my one uh, pan meal and how easy it is. And um, this whole thing that I purchased wow. um, today wasn't even over, like, $10, you guys. It was, like, uh, $8, and that was it, you know. So, even if you have, like, stuff, like, old, like not old stuff, but vegetables and stuff in your refrigerator your freezer and you haven't used it definitely go and use them like put them in the oven roast them off we got to be putting it on top of the stove put it in the oven let the oven do its thing and look how juicy this meat is though that's juicy so i know it's gonna be good and then also you can don't touch that please also you can pair this up with like some jasmine rice or some brown rice i love brown rice so like you can it. put brown rice in um, yeah. your teriyaki, your sweet teriyaki. And yeah, so anyways, you guys, um, this is all, um, this is <laughs> the end of the vlog, you guys. I just wanna kinda come over here and show you guys how I roll, how we roll, how, what we do, um, and how we don't like set up for our meal prep on Sundays. Saturday is the day, um, because Sunday is relaxation day. Um, so, um, yeah, but anywho. I definitely will see you guys tomorrow. Um, if not tomorrow, then Monday. I did get a chance to send the 4K gift cards out, you guys. So um, be looking out for that. The two people that um, I sent them out, be looking for your gift, your 4K gift cards. I sent them out today. I was going to get them out yesterday, um, but I didn't make it to the post office because I was so tired. But I did. Send them out today, so they should be going out um, at least delivered to another post office, I guess, or whatever. I don't know how it works with the post office, but yeah, I sent them out. But anywho, I love you guys so much. Be blessed, stay blessed, and have a nice day. Bye. Wait.